Hey, this is Brett, and this 2023 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon four-door 4xe is stock number 24J240A. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used Jeep and Jeep Wrangler headquarters. This 2023 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 4xe has the two liter turbocharged four cylinder engine paired up with the hybrid system. It puts out 375 horsepower. Now this one's gonna get you 49 miles per gallon equivalent and has an all electric range of 21 miles. It also has a um, combined range of 370 miles on it. This Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off and it is 100% ready to go. Ultra clean all the way around and very good looking. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up, take a look under the hood, show you all the options and give you the most accurate representation that I can of the vehicle. Bright white clear coat is the color I shoot all my videos in 4K. If you like the video, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel, click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle and specifically Jeep Wrangler walkarounds on YouTube. Over 500 videos of Wranglers on there, over 9,000 videos total. And uh, stay current on our, and up to date on our ever-changing and vast Jeep Wrangler inventory here at Summit Automotive. Getting started, we have the 17-inch painted and polished aluminum wheels and you get the blue Jeep logo on there with the hybrid package. It also has BF Goodrich all-terrain TAK02 tires. These are LT285 70R17s and they have just about I'd say 70 to 80 percent of the tread left on them. Frame and underbody is in nice condition. This is in this is a one owner clean title history clean Carfax from right here in Wisconsin. Front fender is in excellent condition. You get all the LED lights on this one which is a nice thing to have since this was, that was an option in 2023. And I will turn all those on at the end of the video so you can see just how bright they are. You get the blue tow hooks on there, the seven slotted granite crystal inlays on the grill, the LED headlamps and running lights. You get the sport hood. You also get the four by E decal on the hood there with the anti-glare sticker or decal. You also get the kind of low gloss Rubicon lettering with the hydro blue outline and the Jeep logo there. Passenger side front wheel, excellent condition, no scuffs or scrapes on there. And the passenger side front fender is in excellent condition as well. As you go down this side of this 2023 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 4xE, just take note of how clean the body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. I take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the vehicle, hear the vehicle, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. Now, if this video helps you make that buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful and that Brett sent you back wheel, excellent condition as well. And the back tires have just as much tread as the front tires. Frame and underbody is in really nice shape. It does look like it was professionally undercoated by somebody. We did not do that, but uh, we took this one in on trade and uh, it does have the nice rock rails on there. I always like showing the door hinges to make sure that they're not all corroded or chipped up. These are in pretty nice condition. The T50 on there is the Torx bit that you have to use to get those doors off. If you ever want to see how to get your doors off, we did a video. That's in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. The hard top is in excellent condition as well. I didn't see any major scuffs or scrapes on there. Coming around to the back. So this is what a brand new tire looks like. This one's never been on the vehicle other than on the back and uh, that back wheel is matching, of course. This one does have the towing package with the receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. It has a max tow capacity of 3,500 pounds. You get the blue tow hook back here as well and the LED tail lamps. There is your case for the front hard top pieces. This one also has the Alpine premium sound system. So you get the factory subwoofer back here. You also have the white or the color matching 
rails back here. So when you have that hard top off, it looks really good. This is your charger uh, in this bag here, or the cord to charge it, I should say. Door hinge, roof, and windshield bolts. And it's really easy to get these hard tops off. There's four bolts on each side, two quick disconnects. We actually did a demo on how to take your hard top off your JL Wrangler. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. One little Easter egg, you get seven slots on the back here. There's your JL badge with the two door, four door wheelbase and overall length, as well as water fording and your outside width of your tires and uh, the middle width of your tires. Made in USA, developed in Auburn Hills, Michigan, built in Toledo, Ohio. Door shuts nice and solidly. And as you go down the driver's side, just as clean as that passenger side, once again, that hard top's in great shape. And the rear quarter and doors all look good. No dents or dings, and this back wheel is in excellent shape as well. And down the rest of the side of the vehicle, these door hinges all look very good. And the back seats are in excellent condition. No rips or tears back here. You get the cloth interior with the blue stitching. Once again, all part of that hybrid package. So these seats do fold up and they're a little different than the normal Wranglers because your batteries are actually underneath here. The normal Wranglers just, uh, the whole seat goes down, but this piece has to go up and then this seat folds down like that. So they are a little bit higher up from the back storage area. So there is a lip there, um, but you can see that's how that works. And there is a Jeep Easter egg right there. Uh, back here, window controls, two USBs, two USB-Cs, 115 volt, 150 watt plug-in. Comes with a set of WeatherTech floor mats back here. Child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look good. Up front, the Rubicon package also gives you the black cloth bucket seats. You get the blue Rubicon stitching on the backrest there. And you get this honeycomb design on the center parts. No rips, no tears, driver's seat, height adjuster, weather tech floor mats up front as well. So this is where you control your hybrid system. You can have it be a hybrid system, an electric system. So just uh, running on the batteries and then an e-save, which basically just runs on the gasoline engine. Auto headlamps, tilt telescopic steering wheel, power windows or power locks and power mirrors right there. The power windows are on the center stack. We'll hop inside, check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this one has to offer on the interior. You get the Rubicon 4xE animation at the beginning on the seven inch LCD display there. Digital speedometer, 21,179 miles, and the instrument cluster is very nice and clean. Uh, you can see if you're charging over here, you can also see how much battery is left, and then your um, range as well. Has the heated leather wrapped steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left, and audio controls on the back of the steering wheel. You get the blue stitching on the steering wheel there as well. And uh, this one comes with the 8.4 Uconnect 4C radio. It does have AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities. You also have Bluetooth, AUX, and USB hookups. You also have your climate controls on here, including your dual climate controls. You have your heated seats and heated steering wheel controls. And you have your backup camera, which they've made those crystal clear HD. So you can get hooked up to your boat camper or trailer the first time every time. You also have your same screen there. Uh, here are your different apps. This one does have projection manager. We can project your cell phone to the screen via Android Auto or Apple CarPlay. We did a demo on Android Auto. If you want to check that out, that's in the upper right hand part of the screen and linked in the description below. Then these are the off-road pages. They do take a second to load. So while they are loading down here, your more tactile volume tune and climate controls, including your heated seats, heated steering wheel controls, dual climate controls. And then I'll get to those buttons in a second. Here are your off-road pages. You get your different steering angles. So as I turn the wheel, you can see that angle changes and the wheels actually turn up there as well. That's pretty cool. You got your sway bar if it's connected or disconnected, front axle and rear axle if they're locked or unlocked. And then if you're in too high, four high or four low, you also have latitude, longitude and altitude on there. 
get your different accessory gauges and your pitch and roll, which would be really great if you were off-roading in this thing. And uh, that's pretty much it up there. So down here, this is your max regeneration mode. So what that'll do is it'll actually use the brakes and the inertia of the car to slow you down and recharge those batteries on the hybrid system. Stability control. This is your speed select crawl control, and then you can turn the screen off there as well. It does have a USB, USB-C, and an AUX jack. Here are your window controls, and this is what makes a Rubicon a Rubicon. You can have the front and rear axles locked, or just the rear locked, and you get a sway bar disconnect right there. Four upfitter switches, and then your 8-speed automatic transmission. You also have your 4x4 shifter there with 4 auto for high auto and for high part-time. Keyless entry with remote start and your hazard lights does have the flipper key. Always liked those keys. And uh, you also get the mineral gray dash trim. So it's actually got a little bit of metal flake to it. Kind of a cool color. Like those a lot better than the red ones. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in excellent condition. And there are those front hardtop pieces with the crushed eggshell finish to them. They're in very nice shape. I don't think they've ever been off the vehicle, to be honest. Assist and SOS buttons, and then the auto dimming mirror. You also have your home link buttons for your garage door security systems and lighting systems. So I'm going to start it up. No guarantee it's actually going to start the gas engine, but... Oh, there we go. So it started right up. We'll turn all those LED lights on so you can see just how bright they are. And I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. Also, here is where you charge your vehicle. Just plug the plug in right there. Plug it into the wall. And it's ready to go. These take about 12 hours to charge on a one on a 120, and they take about two two and a half hours on a 240 charge. See all those LED lights? They are very bright. We'll take a look under the hood. Like I said, I'd personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality condition options and of course cleanliness of this Jeep all the way around inside and out. Under the hood, we have the 2-liter turbocharged 4-cylinder engine. And when combined with the hybrid system, once again, 375 horsepower. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. And once again, this Jeep has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. Has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off. There is the emission sticker. And this Jeep is 100% ready to go. I'd highly recommend it from a quality and condition standpoint. I didn't see a single dent or ding on it and uh, really clean inside, non-smoker and just really clean outside, great condition. And uh, to see more, I'd hi highly recommend it. I'd ship this one anywhere, California, Texas, New York, Florida, whoever's going to get this Jeep is going to absolutely love it. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans and specifically Wranglers. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you want to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as have access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube. And stay current on our ever-changing and vast inventory, and specifically Wrangler inventory here at Summit Auto. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to all the Wrangler videos I've ever done in the upper right, a link to this vehicle on our website in the lower left, and a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in the lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this Ultra Clean 2023 Jeep Wrangler Rubicon 4-door 4xE in bright white clear coat. Thank you so much for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again, and have a great day.